yeah hi we are from svs embedded the project title name is iot based person by wheelchair fall detection using raspberry pi pico so here we are using term tcp app whenever the fall occurred that should be dis send the data to our android app so here we are using 5 volts power supply module raspberry pi pico rp2040 and accelerometer sensor mpu6050 like a front fall, left fall, back fall, like that all fall detections, buzzer, button, for if it is wrong fall, you can press the button, buzzer sound, 16, 17th pin, 16 cross 2 LC display, RS enable, D4, D5, D6, D7, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, LCD data line pins, and ESP8266, it is connected to the 9th pin of transmitting pin, Raspberry Pi transmitting the data to Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi module is sending the data to our term TCP app. And wheelchair motor for a demo purpose. I am using small motor. It is connected to the 16th pin. So let us coming into the hardware part. So 230 input step down transformer 9 volts output AC. Bridge rectifier filter capacitor 7805 regulator and one LED power supply module. And Raspberry Pi Pico. And this is a, a reset button or wrong wrong fall detection you can press that button alarm and mpu6050 accelerometer sensor i2c based accelerometer sensor and wi-fi esp8266 and uh, ip address is 192.168.4.1 column with 80 port number wheelchair small dc motor and 16 cross 2 lc display character lcd display whatever the process is going on that should be displayed on the lcd power supply Raspberry Pi Pico, 16 cross 2 LC display, alarm and fall detection sensor, Wi-Fi module and first you have to go for the now let's go for settings settings Wi-Fi Wi-Fi and there is one AI thinker module you can press this AI thinker and it will connect it as AI thinker module is connected then come here and press term tcp app and you can create connect 192.168.4.1 connect it it will come and then press reset button i will check wi-fi connected echo finding network Wi-Fi module is connected. Wi-Fi network okay. Wi-Fi module connected. Open TCP app. No small DC motor will rotate. Okay. If, if, if anything is fault, you need to press that button. And if I am going for the fault detection. back fall if it is wrong fall you have to press that button with 5 seconds if there is a fall is correct it will show you on the LCD in the monitor it is a fall occur back fall detected so now it is stationary position motor is rotating okay Okay, you have to press restart. Okay, 86 and 86. Okay. Front fall. So, it, this is front fall back fall left fall right fall there is a four directions right fall left fall front fall back fall
फ्रंट फॉल लेफ्ट टू फॉल लेफ्ट टू फॉल बैक फॉल thinking you if there is any doubt let me know to svs embedded